Misty Valley here with another episode of Paleo Pines Demo. We're going to continue on and see what we can find out. All right. Cute. Marlowe sells pen decor that can change the vinyl. I did not know that. Well, hello, Owen. See how much stamina we can use. Oh, I got a watermark across, so I can't do that. Hi, Owen. Good morning. Sorry to show up unannounced. I was hoping to update my data on the Parasaur. Excuse me, I just about choked. Parasaurolophus. As you can imagine, it's rather sketchy. You think? Or is it a Parasaurolophi? I don't even know the pluralization. I've never met one. Mine, never mind two. Anyway, I noticed you've acquired a new friend, a Gallimimus. And you've barely been here a week. It took me months to get Bongo to follow me home. Now, I don't mean to brag, but I'm the kind of expert around here on Gallimimus. In fact, I've got volumes of information on dinosaur care. Some observed, much theoretical or extrapolated, but all useful. Is there anything that might be vexing you with regard to Gallimimus care or dinosaur happiness in general? Um, I don't know, pen? When caring for a dinosaur, their pen represents a space they can call their own. They like their pen to be a decent size, a comparative to themselves, and be fully enclosed. So don't leave any gaps in your pens. Well, not fully enclosed with a gate, of course, and the gate is always open so they can come and go as they please. A good pen needs a place to eat, a place to sleep, and to be kept tidy. Uh, <clears throat> you'll know what I mean about keeping tidy soon enough. Trust me, you'll want a shovel. Anything else you'd like to know about a diet? Uh, just like people, Dinosaurs can be finicky about what, when, and how much they eat. First, quantity. It shouldn't surprise you that big ones eat big meals, small ones eat small wheels. Best to keep the troughs topped up. So don't leave like one piece of dino food in the trough. They'll be a little unhappy. Try and have it at least halfway or full. Second, basic nutrition. Herbivores eat herbo kibble. Carnivores eat carno kibble. Simple. You can purchase both at Pebble Plaza from Corland Stall. By the way, don't go putting carno kibble in an herbivore's trough. That's more insulting than not feeding them at all. And also, don't put a. If you have an omnivore, don't put carno kibble in the same pen as a herbivore. Let the. If you, Let's say you have an omnivore, let them eat herbo food. If you're going to put them in the, in the, um, like Lucky's pen, it just makes it much simpler and everybody's happier. Um, third, flavor. Each species has a few flavors they like and some they cannot stand. For example, Gallimimus generally like crunchy things, carrots, bell peppers, rhubarb. Others might prefer spicy or juicy things. But individually, each dinosaur has a favorite food. Um, Bongo likes garlic. Worst breath ever. I don't have all the answers for every dinosaur, but keep trying things and be sure to keep your findings uh, logged in the journal I gave you. Anything else you'd like to know? Um, trust. Now, the most important thing to remember about living with dinosaurs is you don't own them. They're not pets or property, they're your friends. And it's their choice whether they stay with you or head back out to the wild. And you can see our dino in the background is just like listening to this like, really? Oh my gosh, are you sure? Wow, I never knew that. <laughs> the better you treat them, the more they'll trust you and the longer they'll stick around. If they trust you enough, they'll offer to be your steed. In fact, some might even offer to help out around the ranch. They'll let you know when they're seed worthy, but get yourself a saddle before you do anything like that. Trust me, I learned the hard way. 
and we actually have a saddle in our an extra saddle in our pen. Anything else you'd like to know? Um, we'll do dreamstones. I know that Lucky's pen already has a dreamstone. Dreamstones are the most crucial element to a dinosaur's comfort. Science cannot explain why they love them so much, but they most certainly do. If you haven't got one, you make up one morning and find out they've run off to go find their own. Speaking of which, keep your eyes open. Dreamstones are rare in the wild, but if you're bringing home new friends, you're going to need them. Anything else? No, I think I'm good. Well, I hope you found this conversation enlightening. I have one favor to ask, or perhaps you can accept it as a recommendation. Anything you learn about any species at all, could you please log it in your journal? Your journal is a vessel to a house of new discoveries, learned preferences, traits, flavors, so much more. Use it often and you'll never forget anything. Plus, I may want to compare notes now and then. The life of a scientist is never dull. I see you've made some notes about Gal Gallimimuses already. Most diligent of you. Let's take a closer look at Lucy, shall we? So approach the Gallimimus with your journal in hand. Okay. Okay, see, Lucy is an omnivore. You can see it because it's got the the green and the meat next to it. But since she's going to be sharing a pen with Lucky, she's only getting her herbivore food. If she wants anything else, she can go out and get herself. Um, and her treats, it looks like uh, she enjoys crunchies. Like they said, carrots, bell peppers, rhubarbs, anything crunchy. So anything juicy or soft, like a pear or a watermelon or a cranberry, she is not going to like. And she seems to enjoy the company. She's a happy friend. Um, that heart is how much Lucy trusts you, which isn't very much. The circle around us shows how happy they are right now. The happier a dino is, the more they'll trust you each day. Now, if you excuse me, I've got a big day planned. Destination, my library. Bye. Yeah, this is... This is your dino. Yep. Okay, Lucy, looks like you're all settled in. I'll check back tomorrow with the journal, like Owen told me. I'm still going to check the journal, because... Because um, <clears throat> it'll say over here, like it'll say, it says happy friend. Um, and it says the species, it says the care information. We don't know retreats. And then you look at Lucky, happy helper. Um... He's level four, Lucy's level one, and you can see Lucy has 40 stamina and Lucky has 125. So each time they level up, they're gonna get more stamina. And okay, so you see, I've equipped the watering can and you see in the upper, <laughs> upper left corner of your screen, it has the number nine with water. That's how much, that's how much water I've got in the, well, you didn't water anything. Okay. There we go. So now you see it says six. So that's telling me how many. Oh, you little biscuit. Come back here. All right. Three, two, one. <laughs> and now it's empty, but I still need. Ah, good girl. Okay, she just hopped back up there like a pro. Okay, so we've got all our water. Lucy's still standing out there like she's lost. Oh. Okay, you gotta unequip it before you do anything. Oh my gosh. Left click. Left click. There we go. My goodness. Okay, and just hit the skate button. Lucky, I need you. Okay, so our water, the pen is full. See, there is that. Okay, just bury your head in the food. My goodness. Hungry? Good boy. Yeah, you go, boy. Oh my goodness. Alright, we got places to go, bud. Yay, 
level five now. And we're gonna do this one. Because he's still got some stamina. Okay, now we gotta now I wonder if I get her to follow me. So if I do two, 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 okay, and then I get off the flute, get out of inventory, oh. and get unlucky. Will she follow me? Yes, she'll follow me. Okay. Come on then, girl. Cranberries. Ooh, more food. Free food's the best. And more food. Hello, cuties. Sorry, we're interrupting your play. I, I heard somewhere that you can have the dinos follow you and that it'll give them experience. So we're gonna test that theory out. So we're gonna pop off. We're gonna get our flute out. So wait there, which is, and then we do this and that and, <coughs> excuse me. All right, so Corlin. Do you have any dandelion or clover? There's nothing Uncle Taz loves more. 15 of each. No, sorry. Okay. Well, look what the rat dragon. Wow, thanks. I think I gave her, yeah, I gave her fiber. Okay, so leave. Don't be a stranger. Prepare to custom order. No, okay, so I need to tell her to follow me again. Oh, where are you going? Yes! Okay, get rid of that. And then get rid of that. Oh, okay, lucky, lucky. There we go. Now I don't, I'm hoping this gets her to follow, because you can see in the lower left corner, she's, her portraits are like she's following us. So. Goodness, that water's loud. Oh, are there more pears on the ground? Maybe we could get. There are. Now, Lucy doesn't like them, but somebody else might. There you go. Um. So the only time we can get fiber is for them. Okay, so we can only get it from, ooh, what is this place? Ooh, look, more gemstones. Oh, and more. Oh, gotta get my notebook out. Tamoglun. Ooh, okay, what is Tamoglun? So that's a dream stone. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, there's a dream stone over there, but we can't get it. It's all blocked in. Okay. We're just out exploring. Ooh, I never went this way. Can I go past here? 
Oh. Okay. Oh, and there's a fence. It's blocked. No. I'm gonna go up there and find out what's up there. It looks so pretty. Okay. Um, oh, there's Lucy. I was gonna say, did we lose Lucy? Lucy, come home. Okay, so what's up here? Ooh, another. Ooh, more food. Can't get up there yet. There's, it looks like there's supposed to be a windmill or something up there. I think that's what we see. It's midday. Okay, oh, I can't jump off the stones. So, behind here, this is behind Owen's house. Um, this little bowl, if you, once you start cooking, that's where you cook. The cooking pot, nowhere else, that's where you cook. Okay, so we've got, we just picked up 10 clover. So we've got 23 clover, we need dandelions, because we need to give them to Corwin. And dandelions only grow, oops, I gotta go back this way, um, on hilltops, from what I understand. So I missed this herbivore food. There was no dandelions up here. We got these guys. Maybe there's some dandelions over here. Hi guys, you're cute. No? I wish we could wade across the water. <laughs> oh, we can't get up there. Hi guys, this purple guy is really cute. Yeah, hi. Oh yeah, I'm not adopting you right now. And that is way too many calls. <laughs> That's a complex call system. Then we got a Pachyosaurus over here. They're so cute. That's a complicated call system too, my gosh. And I can't get you because there's a wall there. Back and look. Clover, anyone? Clover? Clover? Oops. Go this way. And this is Owen's house again. And do we need Owen? We do need Owen. I don't know what we need now, but... This is frustrating. Thanks to the wind, some of my research blew into the pond and got ruined. At least I think it was the wind. It might have been my dopey gallimimus. That's right, Bongo. I'm talking to you. You wouldn't have to have five small stones that would keep all my papers down, would you? Yeah, sure. Brilliant. Thank you so much for your generosity. Have these potatoes. And it just occurred to me that the potatoes also would have made great paperweights. Oh, well. Live and learn. <laughs> okay. Lucky. Okay, you want... Okay. <clears throat> Good boy. No. Okay, now you're just being an attention hog, babe. There we go. Alright, excuse me, Lucy. We gotta go up to Mars. I know there's some dandelions up there. Ooh, more food. Yes. The more food, the better. There's so many rolling hills. It's lovely. So we're looking for dandelions. And I don't see any. Ah, here's some dandelions. That was one, really? No, that was three. Okay. Okay, so we got seven. And okay. <laughs> oh my goodness. No, I can't go up any further that way. <clears throat> uh, let's see if I can get some in the next valley. Maybe. Can I get some over here? There is a hill over here. Ooh, oh my gosh, yes. Look at all this. Hello. Boink. Ah. 
dandelions. So this is to the left of that bridge over there. Kind of. There we go. <laughs> I was too far. Um, did we lose Lucy? Um, I think we lost Lucy. See, there's another thing over there, but we can't get there. It's blocked. Where is Lucy? And these guys are super fast. They're the ones that you see at the beginning of the uh, game when you're making your, uh, right before you make your character. Look, they're cute. Oh my goodness. My gosh. Okay, no, we're not getting a new friend right now. We got enough on our hands. We just lost Lucy. Is she still up here? If she's not behind us. Uh, Lucy, are you up? You are still up here. Why are you up here? Hello? I shouldn't have to tell you to follow me again, should I? Hello? Okay, so now we got 25 dandelions and 23, so we can go back to Porlin. And he should, his quest should be done. There's more cranberries, but I'm not going to stop and get them. Are you coming? I saw your tail. There you go. Okay, we don't want to leave you here. <laughs> oh my gosh, was that the fridge creaking? <laughs> oh no. That didn't sound good. Now, if you want to see fast, you can press your shift key, and that'll make them go super fast. It also uses up their stamina. So you don't want to do it too often, especially when you have a dino whose stamina is low. No, 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 no. Nope. Stay. Wait there. Three. Eh, inventory. <clears throat> okay, there we go. Buying, selling, what can I do before? <clears throat> sure, there you go. Uh, no. Okay, just shells and Can't blame the guy for trying. You made my Uncle Taz really happy. Okay, you'll be back. <laughs> it's almost like a threat. You'll be back. Okay. Meow. Different weathers. Oh, we have we're gonna have weather in the game? Cool. Till tomorrow. Alright. 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 Good kids. <clears throat> Where'd Lucy go? She's over there investigating. 
All right, so we're gonna go to sleep. Sorry, I'm looking at the time. Writing her diary is saving it. <clears throat> and go to sleep. And if you look in Paleopine's Discord, there, Lucy's now a helper. Oh, how cool. So Lucy can have a saddle now. But if you look in Paleopine's Discord right now, this is, today is the 16th of August. There is a, um, in one of the threads, there is a lucky plushie that is on sale and they give you a link to the shop and it's on sale for I think seven more days. Um, it won't, you won't get it until like November, I think, but they need another hundred maybe to get it. But um, I'll try and put the link in the, and pin the link in the bottom of my uh, video, but um, it looks really cute. I'm gonna get it today. Look around the ranch for a saddle. I'm looking for seeds right now. There's seeds, see this little bag right here? That's carrot seeds. And there's some more carrot seeds right over here. Or maybe spring onion seeds. So just seeds in general. And here's another one. Oh my goodness, there's all over the place. So we got some more spring onion. So sometimes seeds will blow onto your ranch. Okay, so we've still got a, oops. So we've got 10 and 20, so I need to fill up the trough. Um, oh, there's the saddle. So I can now put the saddle on Lucy. Lucy. So you hold the saddle and you go out to your friend and you left click. And then now Lucy can help you. Lucky, don't be jealous. <laughs> Lucy can now help you water some crops. So you can pop on Lucy. Um, she can't dig up the stones and stuff like Lucky can. Look at that tail. That tail is so cute. You can go here. Press left mouse key to, to fill up. Come on, you can do it. I know you can do it, Lucy. Lucy, there we go, okay. So now she's taking a big gulp of water. So you walk her over here and then you left click. And she just sprays your entire crop and she's leveled up. <laughs> that is very convenient. And then she can go really fast. If you press your space key, she can go super fast. Look how fast she goes, my goodness. She's a speedy girl. Yes, she is. Oh my gosh. All right, well, that's where we're gonna end it today, folks. So thank you so much for joining. And I'm sorry, this is so much shorter than my other one. I will make some more videos on this, this lovely game, Paleo Pines, and I will see you next time. Bye now.